Hey there guys, so with 2015 here, I just wanted to share with you um, five highlights of my 2014 experiences. So here we go. So fifth on my list is the Backstreet Boys concert that I went to back in May. Um, I realize this is a little bit embarrassing, but uh, they were a big part of my childhood. I mean, my first CD was one of theirs. So I just wanted to be able to see them in concert before they disbanded again. Um, so yeah, it was a, a, a great concert and I loved every minute of it. I'm not embarrassed at all. Uh, fourth on the list is an event I shot in Canmore. Um, this is the first big event that I got to shoot by myself. So, yeah, this was a, a big milestone for me to conquer, and it was amazing. Um, yeah, I got to meet Chandra, who was a gold medalist in uh, cross-country skiing back um, in the early 2000s. And the event was great. It was a lot of fun. Uh, this is another event leading up to um, the third on the list, but um, yeah, I got to take pictures of Gord Banford, who's a, a great country singer. Um, yeah, great guy. I got to tap his shoulder just so I can take pictures of him with, with his table. Um, but yeah, this is the third on my list. Uh, this is an event I shot that had um, Cirque du Soleil performers there. Um, yeah, I got to shoot them with uh, the guests there, and they were great, they were very engaging, um, amusing, entertaining, everything. Um, so yeah, they didn't really speak words, but you could tell what they were trying to communicate through their body language, so fantastic entertainers. Um, yeah, and a lot of fun poses to shoot, so they were never boring, and just a whole lot of fun that night. And yeah, this here is the Cirque du Soleil show that they had. It wasn't very long, um, it was just the, the key moment of that night, but it was only 12 minutes. Um, and it was a great performance. It's, it's technically the first show I've seen of them, and I was very happy that I got to shoot it with my professional gear. Because if I were to go to an actual show, I don't think I'd be able to bring my camera in. So. Um, to be given this opportunity to shoot them. Um, they're great, great athletes. Um, and yeah, just an overall entertaining lights, music, dance, show performance. Um, I hope to see them again, um, just, just for fun. So this is second on the list. Um, this is my uh, trip to Vancouver for a shoot um, by the harbor front. So this is my manager here. Um, and yeah, we just both traveled to Vancouver that day and sh uh, met up with the event coordinator that, that afternoon. And yeah, if you're given a chance to go to BC, um, I would totally recommend it. The mountains are beautiful there. And just the scenery is just breathtaking. Um, this is the first big event that I shot, um, so I learned a lot about overshooting and editing at night and getting very little sleep and shooting the next morning. Uh, yeah, a lot of a lot of important people there and a lot of great shows as well. So this was a very great experience. I was also able to um, walk around downtown on my time off. Got to meet John Montgomery, another. Um, medalist so great experience and this leads us to uh, my number one uh, which is my trip to Hong Kong um, this is part of a video that I took too um, but yeah so this is my grandma's house um, a lot of memories there every time we go to Hong Kong we stay there this is the MTR station um, so yeah, just a lot of great shopping, great time, um, 
going to Disney with my sister, uh, and also just the main thing was just um, meeting up with relatives that I haven't seen in a really long, long time, and I'm um, trying my hand at my broken Cantonese. So uh, yeah, just great catching up with my cousins and aunts and uncles, and seeing my grandma. So. It's a great trip, I love traveling, and this was definitely the, the best highlight of my 2014. So yeah, those were my experiences in 2014, hope yours were great as well. Um, thank you for watching the video, and I look forward to 2015. See you later!